and I haven't shown you the Coliseum yet. You know what, I haven't actually researched this very well, so this might not be such a good idea. But, this is the Coliseum. Notice the music. Last time we heard this, I said it brought back bad memories. This is why. This is Dragon Lake Coliseum. Champions from all over the world. Yeah, I think that's what the other guy said. The more precious the item wager, the better your prize will be. Look at me. I'm a receptionist. Gufahaha. Now you better watch what you bet, or Master Chupon will just come and take it from you. Yeah, it's still, a lot of times, if you bet an item that doesn't have a particular outcome, you can, you'll just fight Chupon, and no matter what happens, you'll lose. I don't know if you lose the item. I don't think you do, though. Probably the last one. That's some valuable information for you. Talk to the Emperor twice. That's right. I never did that. Uh-huh. I gotta go back there and talk to him. Someone's been pretending to be me. Don't be fooled. Well, at least you were smart enough to check the armor, right? Care to fight the Coliseum? With pleasure. Now you just gotta pick an item to bet, so we're gonna bet the Striker. And this is how we meet up with Shadow. And then you pick a character to go into battle with him. Now, as far as I remember, you can't really control your character in this battle. The computer's just going to decide for you what happens. But it looks like this fight is pretty much set up so that you're going to win no matter what. And you get your striker back, but uh, do you actually get anything else? I don't think so. What are you doing here? The only thing I know how to do is fight. Why not come with us? Well, first I need to see how far I can get here. Well, I suppose if you say so. Okay, so he's back on the airship now. You can actually bet the Ragnarok sword and get an even better sword called Illumina. But I'm actually, I think I'm going to come back and do that later because I'm not real comfortable. Well, you know what? I got save states. I'm going to give it a shot. Let me just, you know, and I hate to use these on screen. I, you know, you don't know how much I hate to do that, but. But I just want to try this, because if I bet this and I don't win the fight, then I lose it for good. I mean, I lose the item permanently. At least I think I do. Don't you lose the item you bet if you do that? Because it doesn't seem like they would set up the game so that you could actually do that. So that you could actually lose an item that was that important. Because there's some pretty important stuff you can actually bet here. And when you can't control what's happening, you know, it's like... Ooh, look at that. Is that a fire base spell? Oh, whatever it is, it hurts. Mantra. What is he doing that for? That's not going to help him at all. The problem is the computer controls your character, so you can't make the decisions. It's just going to do something random. Most of the time it'll just fight, but you never know. Now, if I had some equipment that absorbs fire, that would be a whole different ball of wax. See there? Good thing I used the save state. So let me try this real quick. Give him the flame shield and try it again. Yeah. See, I'm cheating here, I know, but... Oh, God. See, my credibility, or what little I had of any such thing, is probably totally gone down the toilet now. If for no other reason than that I've used the word toilet in this, let's, you know, two times now. Oh, you know what? Flare is a fire spell, but it doesn't count as one when calculating whether you absorb fire. Oh. oh, tell me it's not that easy. I didn't think so. See, now you just brought him back to life. Or you just healed him. Use the flare star, man. Oh, oh well, so much for that. Well, let me check something. Do we actually lose the sword now because of that? Yeah, we do. We actually do lose the sword. Okay, you know what? Forget about that. I'm not going to do that. Of course, I guess I could have given him some kind of... You know, some kind of immunity to uh, death attacks. That might have helped, but... I'm just going to go do that later, I guess. Because that's a little... I mean, we got Shadow. That's mainly the thing that you want to go there for, is just to get Shadow. We still need to get Go-Go. Once we get Go-Go and do this right here, then we're almost done. So... Well, first you're going to want Strago in your party for this, because, you know, every old man's got to have earrings, right? I wasn't trying to be funny there or anything. I know that wasn't funny at all, so. Go in 
looking for a landing here. Well, that island actually up north is where we're going to be headed, but there's nothing there except for that rock formation. So what you have to do first is come into town. Hey, wait a second. Yeah, we're back. It's like old times. Time to relax. Home sweet home, Alabama. Sweet home, Tomasa. This is terrible. Gungo's hurt. Gungo? Who the hell is Gungo? Gungo, wake up! Who did this to you? It was Hidon, the beast you and I used to hunt. I almost had it. You took on Hidon? Oh! <coughs> Gungo! You idiot! Striker, please, you must avenge me. Oh! <coughs> I will avenge you, brother. Gramps, why are you hesitating? Well, I spent my youth chasing that creature. To do it again at this age is more than I bargained for. Gungo, rest easy, I'll do it for you. Alright, then, let's do it. Grandpa? Just a minute, you don't think you're going alone, do you? Uh, yeah. I spent too many years of my life hunting that thing. It is my obsession, not yours. What are you talking about? But Grandpa, this obsession of yours could easily slay you. You're my grandfather. I can't just sit idly by and watch you go. She's right, you know. Sorry, Realm. I'm so grateful that you care. But it's, as his name implies, the hit on is extremely difficult to find. Hide on. It might be hide on, is how you say that. Unless I go alone, it will not show itself. Next stop, Ebbets Rock. So I actually have to go alone? Holy cow, I didn't know that. Phew. <laughs> She's like, screw this. So it is gonna let you take other people, okay. It's strange that he would allow that after all that conversation we just had. For the first time in 50 years, Ebbets Rock. Oh, we, we already talked to her, yeah. So now that you play through this cutscene, if you come back outside, now there's a cave in that rock formation. So all you gotta do is just cruise on up there and go in for a landing and have a look inside. This is probably gonna be really easy. Oh boy, that's right. I'm hungry. Hungry, 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 hungry. Feed me, otherwise I won't let you buy. I like to eat coral. Have any? I don't have any coral. Skinflint, get out of here! Uh, received two pieces of coral. Alright. Hmm. Opinicus? Hippo? What kind of enemies are this? Opi oh. Hippocampus and Elon. Elan something. Well, whatever they are, they're weak as hell. <coughs> You guys just stand back and let Edgar and save him. Wait a minute, why is Mog in my party? I thought Strago was in here. Wait, where is Strago? Why would... Dude, what just happened there? Did you see that just now? Mog was on the... Okay, uh, I, I don't know. Maybe I'm just on drugs right now or something. Did I just hallucinate that? Why was Mog fighting? Received a piece of coral. Is that like some kind of bug or something? That was the weirdest thing. Strago Realm. Yeah, well, but... Oh, oh my god. Is he Moogle-fied or something? Maybe he's got some kind of status ailment. All his lores are here. Oh my god, that's gotta be the weirdest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> he's Moogle-fied, man! What the heck happened here? Oh my god. It's probably like something really obvious and I'm just totally not even thinking. Well, as long as he's a Moogle, can he equip the Moogle charm? <laughs> Let's see. Uh, no, he can't. Okay. Wait, we just came from over there. We just came from over there. There's that treasure chest again. I like to eat coral. Yeah, here's some. Munch. 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 
Merp. That was great. Bring me some more. I'm not happy unless I have plenty to eat. Well, you fart knocker. Okay, let's get some more. Ooh. Man, I have got to figure out what's going on with that bog, man. He must have some kind of relic or... Oh! I know what it is! I know what it is! He's got the Moogle suit equipped! That's why he looks like Mog. Oh! I never knew that! Dude, you've got to, I, I can't believe all the time I play this game, I never knew that. I never knew that they put in Mog's sprite. Okay, so like, I'm running out of time and stuff.